Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Final Fantasy 3. We're just about to go to the Gold Door Manor because we just got those special boots that we needed to walk everywhere. So, yeah, we're going to head there right now. Now, just a quick note, if you guys watched the ending of last episode, I told you guys that I would grind to get to a certain level. Well, I did that, so it was recommended that you're around level 26. I got everyone to level 27, and right now I'm rocking a Dragoon, a Knight, White Mage, and Black Mage, if you guys are curious. Um... But yeah, so apparently we're supposed to head southward. Now, I don't know where southward, but I guess we will figure that out together as we go. I hate these ones. These guys have the most damage, so you guys are trying to get them on Let's keep going south, but of course, uh, probably heal. Keep going south. It's down here somewhere. And, um, it's down here somewhere. Okay. Alright, another round healing, because I think I absolutely trust me for doing damage time. Okay, no. I'm not exactly sure. Oh, is it here? Yes, it's right here. Okay. Um, okay, let's go in the manor, I guess. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me go ahead and do a quick save -a -roo. I almost forget about this every single time. Alright, now let's go inside the manor. Uh, we can use magic keys. So we used to have a thief, but we don't anymore. But at least now we can use these keys. Nothing in here. Okay. Uh, let's see what type of enemies. Okay, first we got coins. What? No, I don't auto attack just yet. I want to do my own attacks here. Let's do Fira on all of them. 300 damage. Bro, these are coins. Why are coins doing so much damage to me? Okay, fire did do a good bit of damage to him, though. Okay. Please do a bunch of damage. Okay, enough to kill him. I'll take that. I will take that. I don't know if that's a rare spawn or not, but usually coins are a tiny bit rarer than usual. Okay, well, I guess... there's This is just a giant manor, so we'll have to... I don't really know where we're headed here, but I guess we'll just figure it out as we go, I guess, right? Okay, so they don't have that, they don't have a crazy amount of damage. Okay, so these guys aren't crazy hard, but... Nothing here either. Ooh. Chests. Chests. How many of these? Golden sword. Two golden swords. How many? Can, can I equip these? Can I... Are those strong? I'm gonna have to, like, sell those. Okay. Uh, not Thunder Spears. What are these Golden Swords like? Five attack. Okay, these are weak. So maybe they're cell fodder. Or maybe... Huh. Let's head back to where we were. I think I have to do something with those locked rooms. I think there's four of them, so... Yeah, let's do a little healer room, and then we can keep going. All Try another magic key. Okay. Oh. Where does this take us? I guess, do we just run around until we figure out where to go? What I can do with those gold swords. Okay, that means we're on the right path, I'm guessing. Can I just go up here? 
Oh, stairs. I like stairs. An encounter right before the stairs. What the heck are these things? Let's use an arrow and a thunder. Ow, ow. How strong are you? Less than a thousand HP. Okay. Or somewhere near probably around a thousand. What? Okay. That guy survived from a thousand hit. He probably has like literally two HP. Unfortunate. Alright, either way, we got past him. No problemo, dude. Okay, I don't know what's in the next room, so let's give it a healeru. Let's keep moving on. Who's this guy? You will not take my crystal. Instead, you will take a sound thrashing. All right, bro. Let's get it. Oh, he looks sick, though. Boy, no, don't, don't, <laughs> don't, don't auto. Okay, let's go ahead and jump on him. Attack. Um, let's put a cure on all. And then let's just see if Blazaga does anything to him. Does Blazaga do anything? 800. That's not too bad, actually. Um, you know, we'll repeat that same action, actually. Okay. That's fine, actually, because he's a mage. It doesn't matter if he's blind. Another eight. Okay. Not, not too bad so far, but, you know, I won't jump. I'll just attack. Attack. Let's do a Kira on everyone. Let's do another Blazaga. She's dead. Okay, never mind. Well, we used Kira, so we'll be able to get her up next round anyway. Okay, so let's attack. Attack. Item. Let's go ahead and Phoenix down her. And hopefully she doesn't get attacked right away. Okay, good. So, we'll be able to probably get her up before she dies, hopefully. Okay. So, now we should probably do a jump. Hmm, I should probably heal. Unless I don't have any. There. Okay, no. Item. High potion. Okay, there we go. Finally, man. Do another cure on everyone. And then a uh, Blazaga if I could. Don't attack first, please. Okay, killed him. Lunith. Love that guy. Love that guy. I love it when he does that. It's beautiful. He just steps right in and saves him. Okay, let's get a cure. But now I gotta revive Ingus, and he does a good bit of damage, so I need definitely need to get him up. Okay, um... Let's use High Potion on Ingus. Let's use another Phoenix down, I guess. And another Blazaga. Hopefully he doesn't kill anyone this round. Okay, that can't do more than 300, okay. Almost dead, but not dead yet. Okay, and then I know Ark is faster than Luneth, so we'll be able to get that Phoenix up. And then we'll be able to use that high potion. Okay, but yeah, this guy is so annoying, because he literally, he does so much damage, I don't have time to heal everyone. Okay. Attack. Attack. No, I need... I need you to cure up, but I need you to do it quick. And then another Blazaga. But this guy, he attacks. We got that cure off. Okay, I'll say he attacks so stupidly fast, it's annoying. But he still even might kill me, even with like 500 HP, though. Protect? Why are you protecting yourself, you weirdo? <laughs> 180 critical, that's funny. Dude, that's not even a... That's, he's not even protecting himself that much comparatively. He's gonna attack. Go ahead, put another cure on everyone. 
And I got one more Blizzaga to go through. One more Blizzaga. Okay. Everyone's basically fully healed up, so... I don't think he'll be able to kill this turn. Easy. He put his Protect up, but it didn't help him much. It just gave me one more attack round, basically, so... I'll take it. Okay, gain some levels. Let's get it. Gah, stay away, you. If I can't have the crystal, neither will you. You can't do that. He broke it. The crystal is mine. <laughs> By heavens, what's going to happen to the world now? We've got to make our exit and find out. Wait, first things first. Let us acquire this key and free our ship from its bond. True. Chain chain key. Okay, so now we can just get out, right? How's our health? Did we fully heal up? We are, okay. Just wanted to make sure. I don't want to get out of here and find out that I am not healed. Okay, then um, I guess I'm on my way out. It's probably going to take a little bit of running to get out of here, but um, unless this place is devoid of enemies because we killed its boss. I don't know. I haven't gotten an encounter yet, so maybe all the bad guys ran away? Nope. Just as I spoke. Okay, but these guys are different enemies. And they don't do that much damage. Oop. Well, I'll use it. I guess we're gonna go to the end before we do anything crazy, so I don't even care that we're wasting heals. Who are these guys, though, is a real question. I wonder if we're gonna meet a lot of other new enemies. I guess we'll see. Oh, that is the right way. Am I dumb? Yeah, this way. Okay, perfect. Okay. Okay, and then we go south, right? Yeah. And through here, we can get out of this place. Okay. Now, let's head back to the town where we'll be able to free our ship and also go to the inn and we can kind of continue what we were doing here. But first, it's the long walk back. We have Tina Phoenix down from that. What? Okay, real quickly, let's head back into town. Let's use the inn and save. And then we will unlock our thingy. I really need to find some better armor and magic. My mages aren't lacking in damage, but they're lacking in gear. Okay, let's go ahead and... Give it a save. We're all level 28 now. And we can unlock this. Okay, so that means we can fly. So we can kind of more easily explore the continent here. Can I just like roam around and like see everything? I might do that. Because there's no encounters up in the sky, right? So. I could just run around. Yeah, so I guess I'm just gonna run around for a while and I'll just time lapse it. I can't go in there apparently. It won't let me. Okay, so I guess we're first looking for a town. So let's try to track that town down. Okay, can't go in there. Got it. Keep exploring. Right now. Okay, so first, we should head to a place called Duster. 
which is that little island in the middle of nowhere. I think this is it, right? Can't land there, I forgot. Not an airship. Or not a not a spaceship. Is this Duster? Duster it is, okay. Then let's go ahead and take a look around. Are you selling anything interesting? Nope. They're selling mallets, but I don't need mallets. I've got a mage with me. The Dalg Continent is to the south of here, but its entrance is protected by a great wind that blows away anything that comes near. I know, I saw that. Geomancy is very difficult art to master, but once you do, its, it's effects can be devastating. I heard that Saronia has the fastest ship known to man. Okay, let's check out the armorer. You got anything for me? Feathered hat is much better. Room bracers too. Just five seconds ago I said I need better armor for my mages. Finally something. Two of those. Two of those. And those can't really help. But man, I've been waiting for better armor for my mages. Because they're both sitting with leather caps, dude. Literally one defense leather cap, so... There we go, and then I uh, got some room bracers. Against against status ailments, perfect. Let's get the room bracers and feather hat on there. Okay, there we go. Good, good, finally. Thank you for selling something that I actually needed. What about you? You got anything interesting for me? Just harps. Harps and bells. Don't use any of those. Okay. Or powers of nature to use train to magic. Okay. They're really trying to get me to become a geomancer, man. I. No. Odin Supreme, the knight among knights, fearing his own power. He sealed his blight forever in slumber, waiting for the light. Cool song, dude. What'd I do? This is the sound when you get items. Oh, is he a bard? I get it, he's like, singing them. Do I have to talk to every single one of these bards? Man, uh, but a blunder, it's newfound, it led to man's destruction, mortals wound up s six feet under, and yet with the world's distress, four hail from the world's darkness. The light they did track down, and thus brought the smack down, thus banishing man's foolishness. Okay, I'll read them just for your guys' sake, but... Leviathan, the great shit of the lake, bides his time for a day when he could break the chains over his darkness and then awake. Okay. I think that's it. More bards. I'll talk. I really don't want to talk to him, but I'll talk to him. Ch okay, he just made chocobo sounds. I don't like this town. Lord Bahamut, the greatest Drake of all awaits champion before to fall his power, yours alone to call. Okay, I don't really care, dude. Uh, I'm searching for a sword called the Dark Blade. It's no ordinary sword, it's just even forged out of darkness itself. Okay, well, if I find that sword, I'll let you know, big guy. Um, oh, I already slept, didn't I? Okay. I think that's it for this town. These guys, do these guys have a magic? Magic guy? Okay, first, I missed something. Apparently in these earthen drums, I missed that. And there should be another one on the other side. Okay, guys, I think I'm going to end this episode off here. If you guys did enjoy, make sure to like and comment as well to the channel. And I'll see you guys later. God bless and goodbye.